Yo, hello there, my delicious friends. Hope you're doing beautifully well. It's your boy, Mikey Mega Mega, live and back at it again with another episode of Let's Play God of War Ragnarok, live on twitch.tv forward slash Mikey Mega Mega. Thank you very much. Click like, click subscribe. If you're watching over on the YouTube channel, you could say, as of late, I have a date to meet the fates. Let's go. We've worked so hard. I'm very tired. I'm very poorly. <laughs> and we're still live on Twitch. Hey, Vivacious. Hey, Sanric. Hey, Fenrir. We're Welcome found. in. Ah, isn't it always the third place you look? Video game logic, it kind of is. Find the Norns at the Well of Udo. Or Udo? Th is that a D? Hey, Mega, how you doing? Welcome on into the stream. Wake you, I've been here for hours. I know. I know. Yo, guys, let's go. This game has really picked up. Brilliant opening, brilliant beginning. A few ups and downs as we got into the feeling and themes of this game. But now, really strong. Glad to be here. Is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But mm. assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made unwitting guards. Ooh. Delightful. All those whispers you're hearing, that's what I hear when I go live on Twitch. That's what you guys sound like. Okay, eyes open, friends. Stay alert. Oh, that's a dark elf. Hmm. What else? A gear Ubrig, vivacious. All saying hello to the people on YouTube. Yeah, hi. If you are on YouTube right now, wow, well done. Hope you're having a lovely day. Hiya. Ooh. Kratos, ghost of Sparta. Another traveler. Of Olympus, destroyer of fate. He's wearing the traveler's Kratos armor set destroyer. from the last game. Bringer of war. Weapon of the gods turned against his creators. He chases a redemption he knows he can never deserve. He can... Let's get into some action. Oh, I knew that was going to contact. I just wasn't quite quick enough. Get that stagger bar up. I always like to get a bit punchy to get that stagger bar up. Lovely. I can probably beat him manually now. Actually, let's rage it and get my health back. Beautiful. He certainly seems real enough. I hate to tell you, the parts in your mind will be real too. Thoroughly executed. If you give me one bad guy, I will mess up that bad guy. If you give me two bad guys in a tight situation, and then you throw in either those annoying lizards or those annoying eyes or those annoying wisps, I'm fucked. <laughs> I hate the game. But Mega Sanric Boopley, you guys know. I am a stone cold murdering god. You don't F, or you end up bereft. I'm on fire. Yo, I'm working okay. Welcome on in. See, working knows a champion when they see one. Seems he was guarding that way outside. Hmm. Yo, this Mikey Mega Mega is a real, a real master over here. Wow. I'll give him a follow. Yo, Mikey's not messing around. Mikey's a high tier gamer. Wow, I didn't know. Wow. I'll follow his Twitch. 
Welcome on in. <laughs> welcome working. Welcome, welcome. Shit. Ah, okay, this one's more problematic. Hate these guys. Did they just drop their business? Oh, he's dead already. <clears throat> Dark elves. Almost looks familiar, but different. Like a confused memory. A rather hostile memory at that. These fates should know it is. I will not be deterred. Uh, she's right. This landscape is a copy-paste of the area near my house when I was playing as Atreus. This is actually the same bridge. She's right. They, they have legitimately copied the map. I wonder if that was on purpose or if, it's, if that was genuinely to save time. And they knew that they could just kind of write it into the law. Oh, yeah, it's in the universe. It makes sense. Yeah, you are, Mikey. Mm-hmm. That's Ayatollah saying, mm-hmm. He agrees. Mikey has a four-foot mirror so he can see all of himself with a sticker on the top of the arrow pointing down saying, number one gamer. Yeah, that's how I masturbate. <laughs> I stare at myself in a mirror. Oh. Of magic, queen of the Valkyries, witch of the world, Little shield break. breaker of Asgard, destroyer of all she opposes. <laughs> she always finds somebody to blame. Break a shield. She juggle a dickhead. Change. Easy. Oh. Oh, it's a little too far. Let's. We better do the dogs first. That'd be really annoying, boys. Oh, I should have got the tree branch. Damn it. That would have been awesome. <laughs> Yellowstone advert. Mikey games for 14 hours at a time while you sleep. Absolutely. Yeah, gear. We are literally going for the fates again. You are correct. But these are somebody else's fates. No fate but what we make. Hey. Hey. Of the AC. Ah, here we go. Oh. Counselor to I'll, let, I'll let her take care of that. I hate those guys. The They're just so annoying. Of the good let me guess. I'm a long winded know it all and I cannot change. See? You forgot, smartest man alive. In that chain, get that power. Remember, delivery between two to four tomorrow. Oh, oh, ah. Wait, how close to my birthday is it? Fuck. Today's the 14th. It's my birthday the day after tomorrow. Holy shit, that creeps up on you a little bit too quickly. I'm not going to lie. You're awesome. Uh, with any luck, I'm, I've am i almost... Basically, the later well, I stay up... Like genuine hack silver. The later I stay up tonight, the more I fix my sleeping pattern. So I'm just sitting here pushing through my consciousness. Yo, are you guys all going to hang out on my birthday live stream on the 16th? Actually, I might not stream tomorrow. Because, uh, in order to increase my chance of streaming on the 16th. Make sure you're following me on Twitter, both ordeal. my Twitter accounts. At least we won't have I to always tweet ourselves. before I go live. Don't credit your reputation, Mimir. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. What oh, is that? that is annoying things. Magic. Oh, it's massive. Aim for the core. Bloody hell, look at that thing. 
I'm trying to stagger it barehanded for maximum stag. Got that stagger bar? Yep. Stagger. Is that the stagger done? By the I've got to do it again. One more second. close to getting another bad boy down. <sighs> My arm is made of steel right now. I've been squeezing so hard in that fight. I'll be there. Yo, vivacious Mega Sanric. Come join me. Thank you so much. Again, I've just got to power it down so that I can break the thing afterwards. What is that? But not before. A phantom! Rogue magic! Aim for the runic core! Bloody hell! Look at that thing! Yelpha! Hold in! Attack! Okay, that's a double. On your guard, Kratos! 
I know. There we go. There we go. Come on. Oh, I'm icy. I'm icy and I'm weak. Quick. Shit. Come on. It's miles away. Shit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. Hey. Ooh, he's gonna eat it. Beautiful. Well, yet another gift of Fimble. Good work, guys. The Good work. Out of all of us has to What's to check? A piece of a broken ambulance amulet of your dressel. Can be used to allow the amulet to hold oh wow i've got another slot well done can i do that now i have to get that fixed later i think what -da, 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 da that was hard combat action though very very nice this way. That fight was pure stagger bar. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. Like he's in ten sides. We had to go into murder time. I had to activate my vengeful spirit technique. Sorry you had to see that side of me. Yeah, but I'm a stone cold kind again. of boy. Normally I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear. But this is positively awesome. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. I, how very dare you! Babbling! <laughs> Oh, I like Mimir so much. He really is fantastic. Although, to be fair, if I kept a head on my belt, I'd have it facing inwards on the crotch. 24-7 pleasure boat. Alright, eyes open. I don't like the look of this little arena oh. area. Oh, that looks official. Older? <gasps> Alter, listen to me, please. Stop! Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here. Wait! Baldur, come back! Talk to me! I am so sick of your constant measure! What you did to me! What you did to me! Selfish wings! You're in a fight! Oh! Oh, shit. Imagine them thinking I had any desire to be back on this itchy carcass. Is this part of the trick? He's not mine. He's not my I'm friend. Quite serious, brother. Come and collect me. Or oh, the consequences of what we do. Mimi! Secret? Brother, hold off. Why did you never turn on Odin? But I did. I tried to stop him oh. any way I could. Just lie! 
you, Sergeant Odin, from the day you met him to the day he put you in that tree. You're a son of a You watched his wars. You watched him destroy everyone and everything. And you never gave a damn until you turned on you. I know, Seagram. It's true. All of it. But for love of you, I became a better man, a personal lover, an ally to all those who... Were you an ally to Freya in his suffering? To God? To God? Well, these things are so annoying, you've got to get rid of all of them. You also decided that I was dead! You! Lover, watch out! There's more of them! Even now, if you see a violent god in me, then you can't help but call him and call him brother! Oh, God, shit! It is not her. No. Of course. Kratos. You did what you must. Brother, the tree! It's pulling me in! Mimir! Brother, help me! Monster! Atreus! I am coming! Oh, fucking hell! Christ! Why you trust your own son? Yo, Miss KTB, how are you doing? Atreus! I can't see him the way he wants to be seen. Ms. KTB, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Welcome. My name is Mikey, an illustrator from England. I make beginner drawing tutorials on YouTube, game, and art here on Twitch. But I know most of you from the lovely Ms. KTB side. How's the day? How's the stream? Welcome to my slightly longer than it should have been stream. That's all I have to do. And now he's mine. Lovely to see you. We're kind of going through some emotional stuff here. A trial. I am here. Sorry, I'm missing chat. I'm not safe with him. Yeah, let me go find my family. Hey. It's over. Did we pass the test? Didn't feel much like succeeding. I see the door has disappeared. You're welcome in. Carl McCool. Kyle, how are you? Welcome in, guys. Miss KTB, how was your stream? Thank you very much for checking out my wonderful victory. We are currently me. I have no idea where we are in the game. Let's say about halfway at least. Uh, we're trying to find the fates so that we can discover what's going on with Atreus and Odin. Very exciting game. It was interesting. So what was Ms. KTB up to? Was she doing another um, uh, VR chat live stream? Were you guys all in VR with her? Kathy has to clean up Discord now. Father has candy. He's, he's got candy. He's a monster. He got me in the back of his van. Her stream's getting a... Uh, oh, no. It got bot dosed. It wasn't great. Oh, I'm sorry. It got doxed. Oh, what? Like, um, stream chat room doxed. Hopefully not IRL doxed. Oh, I'm sorry. That sounds like a fucking nightmare. Oh, well, fuck that. Well, bless her sweet heart for dropping you guys off over here in the meantime. Is she going to start streaming again in a minute? Twitch and Discord. What the fuck? How does that... Oh, oh, that poor egg. That sounds like a nightmare. Oh. It's IRL stuff. She got IRL doxxed. Oh. Yo, if any of you guys are in touch with her, or if any of you guys... Because I appreciate by the sounds of it then, she's just kind of dropped you off with me so she can sort everything out. If you guys hang out in Ms. KTB's Discord, I'm not a Discord person, could you send her my love? And just, you know, sort of wish her well on my behalf. Just say Mikey says hi, and I'm really sorry to hear it. Oh, fucking hell. Well, hey, well, look, hey, guys, welcome on over here. We're playing a God of War. Uh, if I haven't met any of you guys before in Ms. KTB's stream or previously over here, 
I'm an illustrator. I drew, I draw spicy anime fan art for a living. It's all safe for work, technically. Don't ask me for any details. So there's no nipples. Uh, and I make uh, drawing tutorials on YouTube. And uh, Ms. Katie B has been struggling her damn best for years to try to get me to plug in my 3D Valve Steam headset again and actually do some 3D chatting. <laughs> but it makes me car sick. So I keep putting it, oh, I keep delaying, I keep delaying. Let me have a few more goes on Beat Saber and then I'll start hanging out with you guys on, on the actual chat rooms. Oh, you're here, you're here, you're here. Don't worry, Discord server's set up, so we're well protected. Oh, do, yeah, Miss Katie B, I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh, it sounds like a real shit show. Fuck them. There's always dickheads. Always dickheads. We can only hope that they all get hit by cars when crossing the street. Not that I would ever wish that on anyone. But if I had to wish it on someone... I mean, look, statistically, someone's going to get hit by a car. I can't help that, and it's not my fault. That's statistics. So if we got to pick who, that's... Look... I'm not saying, but I am saying. Anyway. She reacted with excitement because it meant that she's now successful. Oh, she's now a big... What oh, yeah. A Kelpie. She's now a big deal. I've seen many of those <gasps> in these pubs. She must be theirs. Yo! She take us to them. I'll ask her. It's beautiful. Easy. A water horse. Easy. That's right. I love this game. This game is amazing. Are you guys playing it? to talk oh. about whatever the norms put you through no wait where's mine get on oh we're sharing oh she goes in front but when it comes to horse riding that means she's the top and i'm the bottom that's a good lass i'm not complaining lovely creatures but temperamental by reputation in my land they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a kelpie would drown them oh no really no kelpie i know would do such a thing it walks, it walks on water. It walks five hundred to seven k ah, in twenty minutes. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother. Mm. There were the hippocamps. They served the sea god. I battled one upon a titan. That might not be her favorite subject. No Fenrir, Tennessee honey, and a cup of Yorkshire gold. You. Oh, that's fucking dope. Um, you have to be careful with the alcohol. It curdles the milk in your tea. You can put a little in, but you can't put in a lot. Wow. So that's what it's like riding a Kelpie. Oh, it's greener than it was a minute ago. Good girl. We're here. Look, she, own hideaway. she's so... Never doubted we'd make it. She's so lovely and damp. Wow, we found that horse and rode that horse and finished riding that horse. In a space of moments. Oh no. Oh no. Look at the underwater area. We've entered the Gungan Kingdom, guys. I'm so sorry. We've just entered the worst part of the Phantom Menace. Why are you, Kratos, coming to my kingdom? <laughs> Kill me now. Kill me now. Uh, Mr. Fighter got a war. Sorry, I, I know that's not why you're here. I know you're not here for this. But I've had a very long day and a very long stream. I'm going a bit loopy. Ah. This looks fascinating, by the way. Look at these curtains of kelp and or jelly, golden jellyfish. Have I missed anything down here? It's beautiful. I'm glad the horse is waiting. So this is where they reside. Under the lake. Jenna, yeah. Describing the perfect date. She's so lovely and damp. Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head. Enter the home of the Norns. Tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Welcome on in. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son. son. <laughs> you know the Yo. child is an Asgard. No, you seek 
what all who search for us seek. To know the ending to your story. Is one young, one old, one medium? The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. No, <laughs> oh, he fails. <laughs> You come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts, as if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak plain. <laughs> she looks like a character from the Dark Crystal. You will die, Kratos of Sparta. But you, but you called him the, the destroyer, destroyer of fate. fate. There, there must, must be a way, a way to, to subvert, subvert destiny. destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. Protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable, merely make us seem prescient. When, when my, my son, son was born, born shut up! up. <laughs> <laughs> your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did, it was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? Um, yeah. You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard. Ooh. And you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. Huh. Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in storycraft. We are yeah, leaving. leaving. Yo, they like the. F Do you remember when Sandman met he the Fates in away, the Sandman TV show? Followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. Maybe ask some more questions. <laughs> it was very difficult to get here. I feel like we might utilize them a bit more than that. Well, that was educational. <laughs> maybe, well, well, let's ask, let's, maybe they have more wisdom. It just took me like three hours to get here. It took me three hours of gameplay to find this place. I spoke to them for less than three minutes. Twitch.tv forward slash monkey mega mega. What a waste of my evening. Yeah, oh, yeah. That was very anticlimactic. One question, one answer. I really did like their design. And that whole young, medium, old, uh, the virgin, the crone, the maiden. Is that how it goes? The maiden, the mother, the crone. Uh, it was just like the three fates from the Sandman TV show. Yo, Kyle, thank you very much for the follow, by the way, dude. Appreciate you, though. Uh, yeah, and their design very much looked like the Dark Crystal. Fascinating, wonderful, insightful, disappointing... But we have three major antagonists left on the plate. We've got four. Problematic. But I reckon we won't kill four. We've got Odin. Problematic. We might kill Odin. And we've got Heimdall. Problematic. He can go. We Nobody likes Heimdall. His sword is called Good Head. Ollie Good Head. No, no, no. Yeah, let me have a look at the law. Are they foes or friends? Uh... Baldur, Magni, Four, Odin, Huntress, Hateful, Alva, Fisk. But they're not friends. Wait, I thought it said they were updated. They're not in the bestiary, are they? Oh, I was really hoping to read up about them. That's so strange. Oh, 
Whoop. Okay, well, that's the end of that then. They just created uh, one paradox. Told Kratos a piece of information he couldn't have known unless somebody with the knowledge from the future could answer. Yeah. Yeah, and it, yeah, because of what he does, he will learn that Heimdall wants to kill his son. No, no, no. I've learned that from you. But to be fair, I'm only speaking to you because of what I've done. So they're technically not lying, but they, they sound so weird about it. We Heimdall, should go this way. the one that oversees the Bifrost between the realms. Yeah, Titan. Yeah, so Titan. What's really fascinating about this game is their completely different interpretation than the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Uh, so this Heimdall watches the wall... Uh, and the edges of the realm of, uh, I forget what that realm's called now already, but uh, it's very, very cool. But he's got the eyes that see everything, uh, a very particular kind of sword called Good Head, and uh, a very particular horn, and uh, golden teeth as well. Let us lead this place. So guys, for anyone who's just popped in, as we're playing the game, I've actually got the, the, Nord the Nordic Pros Edda. So I've got the actual, the book of their gods and shit, and we're kind of like comparing notes between the game and the, uh, old religions. That's better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Ah. Oh. Wait. That tree. Well, oh. isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part what? of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. <laughs> wait. Wait. Was Odin into Brother, asphyxiation wax? they said about the boy? Will but not you... happen. Ugh. Oh, I agree. It will it... not happen. <laughs> we will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how. You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Yeah, Heimdall's a dickhead. Is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with. He's Gavis. black here. It's a black if we beauty have the on the to surface. Eliminate him before Ragnarok. We shouldn't hesitate. Bye bye. Sickling Everyone, say bye bye to the horse. Foresight alone. That is an if of mountainous size. Yo, is Odin about to do a David Carradine, do you reckon? Is that how we're going to stop Ragnarok? We're going to give him a little bit of pornography and some poppers. And then we'll uh, leave him in a cupboard with his old noose. And he'll be like, oh, might as well give myself a treat whilst I'm here. Oh, dear. Um, Sorry, this... I, Now, this is my main thing about the game. Is that this game is absolutely fantastic. And it brings us loads of amazing sights and ideas and concepts. And sometimes... You haven't had a chance to soak in how much great effort has gone into putting something into the game before it's already taken away. We just found a, a kelpie horse that walks on water, swims through the sea, turns green at the bottom and is black on top. And I can't even pet it. And now we have to go and leave it. But this game really is something. Hanging for knowledge or... <laughs> I've come for the hanging. Oh, have you, sir? For knowledge or for pleasure? Pleasure, please. Pop you a ticket. And you, sir, for knowledge. Okay. Go in that queue. Sword girlfriend. Winky to wink. Mm -hmm. Thanks a lot. I'm researching again. <laughs> Don't come in. I'm researching. I did an awful lot of research when I was 13. Let me tell you. Nothing was safe. Thank you. Bloody hell, we have come so far. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure. <laughs> terabytes. We've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother. Kyle, it's I, hardly I, my point. I would never tell you how to live your life, but I would suggest, Kyle... You should look through that one day and maybe boil it down to just five terabytes of the best of the best. If you've got 10 terabytes of research, I would suggest that maybe you've got about five terabytes that you don't really use anymore. Maybe just lower that disk space a little bit. Yeah, do a little bit of pruning. 
If you prune it, all you're doing is really making your collection stronger. I mean, don't get me wrong. I used to have a hard drive in my day. But uh, I, I pruned my hard drive to uh, cut down my um, self-satisfaction to just be a slightly more better person. So uh, whatever's left is like golden. Golden. But at least <laughs> it's not using up so much disk drive. Uh, I have the best of all the best categories and marks. Oh, you're one of these, Kyle. Kyle, you are dangerously like me from five years ago. <laughs> That's a dangerous sign. Like, I know what you're saying all too well. Okay. Kratos, I see something. Ah, Kites has a hard drive now. Will you do a PowerPoint on your research? Guys, oh, not on this platform. Up there. That's going to be on the OnlyPans website. I will, uh... I'll do a guided video tour of Mikey's best suggestions. This one's good when I'm kinky. This one's good when I'm horny. This one's good when I've just got five minutes. This one's good when I've got all night. <laughs> this compilation works great after that video. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> let's cut this. Let's cut this. <clears throat> How do I get up here? Oh. Oh. Ah. Hmm. Wait, is that where we came from? Yeah, we went that way. Okay. So this is quite good. The game is quite good at making you face the direction you have to go when it has to kind of loop you around a little bit. It's much better at doing that now than it was in the beginning of the game when the landscape was in the what? area of the dwarves. I think we're missing the Norn's message. Nidavellir. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. Mm -hmm. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Oh, Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe the truth can be a cruel thing. I'd love a zip line. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Oh. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? Perfect. There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to <coughs> avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going hey, to Asgard. What have I stumbled agree? into? It would be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must Sorry, we're must just comparing die. Grumble collections. How do you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norns. I know how it is. You stumble across an adult actress who looks a lot like that girl you fancied in school. Next thing you know, you've got her entire back catalogue in a compilation. It's nobody's fault. It's nobody's fault. It's a victimless crime. Yeah, let's get out of here before we get in trouble. Adult film pairings, yeah. I need to go and touch some grass. I need to go outside, guys. I need to uh, meet someone. But until then... By the way, excuse me coughing, guys. I'm actually ill. And that's why we're having such a weird stream today. Um, my sleeping pattern's been ruined by a horrible cough. Uh, so um, I've been streaming from about like one or two in the morning for the last few days. And I'm trying to stay up as late as possible. It's currently five o'clock in the afternoon where I live. In the hopes that I'm going to just realign my sleeping pattern. So this was going to be a short stream in the middle of the night. But it's ended up being 15 hours. But you know, that's, that's no one's fault either. Victimless live stream that is. Yo, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Back on the good boys. Back for a good time. Yeah, I'm forcing a reboot. Yeah, absolutely. Let us find a gateway. Return mm. home. Take a sip. Jenna, Zero how is your day plans. going, Jenna? Have you been to bed since I've been streaming since you first Listen, said hello? Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? <laughs> I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. Give your mind a little time to process everything. Oh, if I miss something. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake, though. 
I'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than Midgard. It's your choice, brother. I don't think uh, there is any more unfinished business. I actually did the whole lake before we went up there. Now I'm going to sleep. My brain's going. Yeah, look after yourselves. Guys, level four Blades of Chaos. More powerful than ever before. More handles. We can craft. Pommels of Agile Deceit. Spinning uh, Chaos and Evasive Embers evade attack skills to increase damage. I didn't understand that sentence. But I do understand increased damage. I can upgrade my Pommels of Brutal Might. Stun grabbing an enemy with R3. Grant Strength. That's pretty cool. I can upgrade that to level 5. I'm not going to yet. I'm really holding off all my um, hack silver for upgrades because I'm never 100% sure what I want to commit to. I need another Chaos Flame for that. As for my shields, my Rond of Deflection. Okay, Let's I've now got... <clears throat> that is great. I've got a wider window to time my parries. That is very important for me, so I'm glad about that. I will have that, and I will upgrade it. Parries are important. Oh, their deaths will be painless. Ish. Nary, a good or bad parry. I can upgrade everything else if I want to, but I don't need to. As for my I'll armor. The forge. My wonderful friends, we have... Level 5, Gipt Madora's Breast... Oh, it's silver and steel. Keep Midor's best plate. Armor so beautiful it said whoever wears it becomes instantly more likable and lucky. Uh, I think that armor looks like, well, it looks cool, but for the other armor we've seen in God of War, this looks kind of garbage. Uh, and moderate luck or runic. Wait. And restores 70% of cooldown. Okay, that's actually quite good. Uh, Manny's Pauldron of Wisdom. That's disgu- I actually hate this model. <clears throat> These shapes that's going on here, I don't like this at all. This is a real shame. Because visually, I just hate it. Increase for damage caused by uh, vaporizing and extinguishing flames. So that's when you switch between hot and cold. Uh, I'm just going to go for these, really. A good fit. It's not. I really don't like how it looks. But it's better than the alternative. So, wrist armor. Gauntlets of radiance. I can craft even better spiritual wraps. Wear it with pride. It's pretty cool. But also, we've got Manny's wisdom braces. And uh, Gipman doors again. Let's just do a full Gipdam door. <laughs> I can't even say that word. Wow, I'm so tired. Might be Let's just do a full Gipdam door set. <laughs> whatever, whatever the real word is. Well, I, I do apologize. Am I being racist against Nordic people when I say it badly? Gip, da Gip damn doors waste guard. Just go. Just go before I get cancelled. Gonna keep it spatter free this time. Please don't right? unfollow me on Twitter. Come Kratos? on. Um, no, I wouldn't say it's Chinese or Japanese, but I know what you're thinking about when we look at it. I can see those visual elements, but it's uh, Asian Asian plate armor is just not like that, or old school. But still, I'm streaming on the phone now, so I got some art done. I get to watch some more gameplay. What a chill day. Jenna! <laughs> please don't suggest that I'm going for hours, please. Jenna, I think what you meant to say is I get to watch Mikey go to bed. I'm going to go into um, I'm Only Sleeping, and I'll sleep right here. The underlayer is weird. Yeah, I know. Mm, yeah, I know exactly what you mean. I'm not, I'm really not. Like, I have loved a lot of the armor designs in a previous game. In this game, the template is a little bit similar. There's only kind of three different types and they're a bit samey with different color schemes, which is kind of really weird. I would have loved to have seen a lot more variants. Like in the previous game, you got like the traveler's armor, you got volcanic armor. I'm, I'm sure there's going to be more, but I'm not madly in love with what we're on so far. So I'm looking forward to it changing when the time comes. Anyway, keep gam gob. Is that equipped? I think it is. And my chamulet. Thank you. I'd love to repair my sockets. Uh, we can fit some business in that. Special items? Want something in particular? Yeah, the hilt of Redil. Can you craft this? 
cutter of hearts and the fury of the sky. Mm. Nice. A hilt of Angravald. Upgrades cooldown. Nah, I don't need that one. Be safe. Sindri, I'm so sorry you're injured, but thank you as ever for your support and your help in these wonderful battles. You wonderful people on Twitch, I'm going to go for a wee. I will be right back. Okay. Bang for the buck. This emote describes me perfectly. Yo, Malgrins, how you doing? Malgrins, lovely to see you. How is life? Yeah, I love those emotes. We've got some really good ones now. These animated emotes are so fun. Hey, Kyle, Mega, adorable. Jenna, you silly sausage. Adorable, right back at ya. Sausage. 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 Yo, okay, back to the game. Uh, so, I, I really do think we've actually done everything in this area. Uh, return to Sindri's when ready. As for favours... Uh, all these side quests are a bit bullshitty. I'm going to be like, get some menus. Find a gourd, find a cap, find a melon. Uh, oh, open the raven's gifts. This we do need to do. Uh, find the draugr holes. <laughs> you, have to, you have to get them drunk first. Ah, uh, let's... Yo, we need... Let's actually travel to um our raven reward. More XP, thank you very much. Yo, Geo, my dude. Hey, welcome, Geo. How are you? How have you been? Now, does anybody remember where the realm was? It was with Odin's eyes, right? It's Niflheim. I think we have to go here. Yeah, this is it. One sec. We won't be here long, but it's uh, good to get this out of the way. Let's go drinking and fill some holes. A hole in my heart. How was Sigrun when you saw her last? She's still incorporeal ever since Kratos set her free of her corrupted form. But she hasn't let that stop her from helping any way she can. Oh. The truth is, I owe her more than I can repay. I'm glad the Valkyries are doing okay. Way. When we freed her, she could speak of little else but her reverence for you. Seeing you yourself again would surely be payment enough. Hmm. Wait. Wait a minute, does this... Okay, guys, random question. But my God of War PlayStation 4 save data has been copied on my PS5. Does this game read my God of War 4 save data at all? Because, you know, you don't have to fight the Valkyries. But she knows that I have? Or are they just assuming that I have? It's like, uh, do you remember Metal Gear Solid? My god, do you remember playing Metal Gear Solid and fighting Psycho Mantis? And it goes really meta, and he reads your memory card save data, and he tells you what other games you were playing. And he can read your attacks unless you put the controller into the, play into the Player 2 port. That was so inventive. Like, they don't make games like that anymore. That's such, like, a crazy wild thing to do. Holly! Holly, welcome back. How are you doing, Holly? How's your day been going? Guys, welcome on in. It looks like I've caught a load of you on the evening. So I'm assuming in America or Europe or wherever, some of you guys are coming back home from work or waking up. Uh, so hi, guys. And Steampunk Witch Kalidra. Wait, why is everybody turning up now? Okay, guys. Next time I do a daytime live stream, I should start my stream at 5 o'clock English time. Because it appears to be that's when everybody's suddenly saying hello to me. Lovely to see you. Steampunk Winch, you... Steampunk Winch? <laughs> Steampunk Witch Kalidra, you lovely thing. How are you? Tell me all about your day. America, we're going into work. You guys are going into work now. Ah, so people who are watching me from work, you know, keeping it lazy on another tap. Okay, brilliant. Good to know. I'll have to do a proper audit one day of my audience to work out if I ever do have a schedule. But if I ever do... Then uh, I know when. Oh, it's quite early in America. Oh, okay. I'm fine, and you? Uh, Gleedra, I feel awful. Juice. Juice. I feel terrible. Nicked gut. I've been very ill. And I've got a horrible cough. I'm better than I was. I'm much better now. But it's ruined my sleeping pattern. And my mental health. <laughs> and my outlook. All I know now is God of War. All I am is God of War, Ragnarok. 
all day, all night, every day, every night. But not when the sun shines. So that's when I'm sleeping. Why? You're younger than me. I know, but I, I live my life worse than you do. You clearly look after yourself. You're gorgeous. Seems I'm a wreck. Like you might need the help. I'm like a used sock. And not on the foot. Now. Allow me to get my rewards. What is this? Ravens. The ones we've been destroying. Odin's little spies. But they're freed from his uh, control. By the father of all. We swung from the tree. Wisdom gained father. Servitude gained we. They seem happy to be out from under it. What do you suppose that means? And here I thought you were good with riddles. David Carradine. Asphyxy wank. I understand. I love Elder Scrolls so much. Oh, are you are you hard on uh, Elder Scrolls? Yeah. God of War only. God of War forever. We did do some artwork, but mostly God of War. Hey, ah, uh, I'm doing my TPS reports. Ah, uh, <laughs> good for you, Fenru. Good for you. What have we got? You're welcome. So destroying the ravens free their spirit somehow. Good to know. Free. Well, we have Odin's control anyway. Let's check out these ravens' braces then. Braces of raven's tears. Increases healing from heal stones. Rage and gear. Oh, this increases my rage healing. Uh, yeah, actually, yeah. I might be able to upgrade that in a sec. Uh, ooh, and let's fill my slot. Careful, ladies. Remedy of a Bifrost. Successful attacks cleanse a small amount of Bifrost. Dodge rolling will hasten the expiration of burning and poison and frost. I mean, that's quite a good idea. That should be a mechanic anyway. Uh, blind and daze. Increased damage of death from above. Mm -hmm -hmm. Uh, let's go back to that melee. Melee, melee, melee. Accessory. Tier 2 Sonic Aftershocks. Punishment. Melee attacks against an enemy afflicted with a hex get bonus damage. No. It's not good enough. Fascinating, though. Fascinating. Now, we're going to have a quick look in here. I don't think it's upgraded any of the challenges. I think it's still just like an endless battle. I was hoping it was going to... It's not like Mistfulheim. I was hoping it was going to, like, give us another area, maybe. But I'm pretty sure this is it. Oh, wait. Hello. Lytel. Einherars. Draugr's, Grimm's. Okay, that's cool, but it's it's still more of the same. But we've just got more options for opponents. You found some of Tyr's treasures? Oh yeah, bro. Hand them over. I'll hold on to them. Oh. Um, one sec. Health burst. Thank you. Definitely upgrading that one. Mm, a beautiful tree. Oh, this game is be Everything in this game has been so beautiful. Mikey's the most cheerful awful we could hope for. <laughs> yeah, I'm so sorry, guys. Welcome on in to the misery stream. We want to die with a smile that beams. We'll march to the edge of our graves. We'll do it to night and day. Hold my hand and jump straight in. Let's go to hell because of all of our sins. Battle, you say? It's a trap. What else we got? Uh, I could have sworn I would. Go I want to upgrade my ravens things. One sec. You make up your mind. Ah, uh, ah! Oh, I'm just short of hack silver. If I sell this, I should get that back. One sec. Hello. Sure stinks like Midgard. Perfect. Right. That worked great. Wrist braces. Upgrade. 
dreamboat. Right yes, heavily fortified. We got more lip flapping to do or no? Now, this does not look good. This is not my idea of attractive armor. But statistically, quite potent. Uh, talk to him. Don't talk. Don't spin. Why do you stare? He's gonna be fine, you know. I do not. He's getting what he needs. He is in danger. And being with you, he was safe as houses, huh? Never got close to dying. Not even once? I did not come to you for a lecture. I know. It's on the house. My new customer loyalty program. Oh. Speak no more of it. Yo, let's go back to Sindri's. Guys, we have made great progress today. No one, no, nobody talked to that squirrel. Ooh la la. I know Mega, it's so emotional. Now God tell me it. of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My mm. intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Edge of my axe. Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah, the inevitable asking of the dwarves. Ooh. They are getting really meta with everything that's been designed in this game. And everything you do now comes with like a meta commentary. Like, I do definitely feel like they're having a lot more fun in this game than they did in the last one. But it it loosens things up a little bit as well. Oh, brilliant. Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? No, there is. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I've What's been done? I've been ignoring his dialogue prompts the entire game. Every time we've been going last time, he was sitting right here with a big dialogue triangle. I was just like, don't look him in the eye and he won't talk to you. I'm just like, no. <laughs> just go to the door. Master Kratos, it's important we speak at your earliest possible convenience. <laughs> no, no, no. no I, don't, I don't want to know you. I don't want to know you. <laughs> Shh, don't look at him. Don't look at him. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. Yo, more XP, more skills. I have news. Oh. Did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. Mm. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? Oh. And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Rock is so Don't sharp. Get drop near. Drop near? But talk to the Marvel character. <laughs> no, we got plenty. And despair. I don't want to talk to him. Even if we did, drop near's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do but go fetch Dropnir. I'm assuming that's me then. Am, am I fetching Dropnir? Dropnir? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. How will this help me kill Heimdall? Never you mind all that. Is Sindri it's okay? It's a fucking surprise. We're artists. But to even store Dropnir, you'd need... You were saying... So now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood. There's a real sadness about him. Oh, Kalidra, Steampunk Kalidra, if you're still here, if you're not, don't worry, you can't hear me. But if you are, what are you working on at the moment? Are you doing any creative projects? Any artwork?
Oh god, it's like Harry Potter. is a magical ring Heimdall's a threat, not only to okay train. just before we come all the way back up here so for anyone who's just come in we've got the um prose edda here of norse mythology so let's have a quick look at how it is in the mythology compared to the game the Lopnir is a magical ring on item 49 i mean I'm, I'm pretty sure we understand what it is right now anyway but let's have a quick double check <laughs> the death of Boulder and Hermod's ride to hell. Ooh. Then Ganglieri asked, is there still more to be told about the Aesir? Thor accomplished a great feat on that journey. And High replied, one could tell of an event that the Aesir themselves thought more important. The origin of this saga was that Boulder the Good had a series of ominous dreams. He saw his life threatened. And when he told the Aesir about his dreams, they took counsel and decided to seek a truce for Boulder, protecting him from all dangers. Frigg took oaths that Boulder would not be harmed by fire and water, iron and all kinds of metal, stones, the earth, trees, diseases, animals, birds, poisons and snakes. When this was done and became known, Boulder and the Aesir took to amusing themselves by having Boulder stand in front of all of the others at the assembly, or some would shoot at him, some would strike blows, and some would hit him with stones. Whatever was done was no injury, and all thought this remarkable. We haven't got to the... sorry. So this is mostly about Boulder. Where's a... Uh... Oh, uh, this is actually a really long chapter, so let me just see if I can speed through. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, Dropnir is laid by Odin on Baldur's funeral pyre and brought back from hell by Hermod. So it's a magical ring that Odin put on a funeral fire of Baldur. Mm. Oh, where do they talk about it here? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Many from among the frost giants and the mountain giants also came to the funeral. Odin laid the gold ring Dropnir, the dripper, on the pyre. It had the characteristic afterwards that every ninth night eight gold rings of equal weight dripped from it. Baldur's horse with all of its riding gear was led into the pyre. So Dropnir is a ring, a magical ring that Odin laid on the pyre of Boulder after he died at the end of the first game. And after that, it imbued with the power that every ninth night, it dripped eight identical golden rings. Mm. The number nine has been coming up a lot in this book. Sorry to pause the gameplay to just go on a little, little majigger. But, uh, one sec, let me just look at mark number three. Yo, fascinating, fascinating. He's Odin's left hand and he carries the horn that begins right Okay, on. Bionic, hiya, have a lovely day. And it's should... just as likely a trap because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Are you doing Not Warcraft? one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention, we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, that's a relief. <laughs> uh. 
<laughs> Bit excited. Kratos? Whenever you're ready. Mm, sound right. KCS, yeah, yeah, yeah. KCS, you're born in 97, right? No idea what he's on about, we found another video game earlier today, but it was also uh, released in 1997. Called The Dark Earth. Uh, Lily Bo. I can't be around the violence that follows him. That follows you both. I'm sorry. Tia has been decidedly ungod of Wari. Now I don't mind. He can be whoever he wants to be. I'm, I'm not going to force him. Are. But uh, he was very intimidating to find, and then we kind of realised that you know, he's just not about that life anymore. I'm whatever makes him happy. Good for him. But also, you know, Ragnarok is coming, so... Ooh, maybe a little, be a little bit more helpful? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. I can't judge. I can't judge. Uh, right, anything else we have to do here? I've been studying and I can forge some new equipment for you. You can? Not according to my menu. Uh, I think we are going. All right, let's go. He found his piece. Yeah, to be fair. See you out there. Dark Earth. No, it's kind of edgy. Yeah, it's post-apocalyptic kind of adventure puzzle game. But um, uh, for for some unknowable reason, we had it on our Windows ninety seven computer, and uh, I remember playing it as a kid. I I couldn't I couldn't beat it. I couldn't get very far at all. Master Kratos. But it's important we the designs back then, this is right in the zeitgeist of me getting into graphics and designs. Jesus Christ. Um, but like, it just, uh, it's always been in my memory. I've said what I have to say about that squirrel. You know what my opinion is of the squirrel. Ah, time to go see the lady. He wants my credit card information. Oh, no. This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. I you heard him. Quit your friend. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. <sighs> what the? <sighs> no, you pimp shrimps. Has Odin blocked us out? Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. You. Ah! Thank you. What was all that then? Oh, just Sindri trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in need of a been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursion in you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. <laughs> yes. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old. Are oh, you worried about the squirrel? <laughs> never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. Are you feeling anxious about the squirrel? Tell me now. Why do you hesitate? Brock, I need some uh, light reflective glasses. This here's your stop. Oh. Banded service tunnel direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Dwan. Brock. Yo. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust Damn him. right. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. Yo, this is like being in one of the underground cellars in The Witcher 3. Forging destiny, path ahead. Yo, let's go, my delicious friends. It's so good to have you. Let's vibe this game. Let's go. Two Megaverse lore points combined, yes. Mikey, the pros editor of Norse mythology by Neil Gaiman. Uh, I'm assuming Neil Gaiman's going to be an interpretation. Because Neil, I, I would assume. Uh, I have the pros editor, and it's got all this kind of stories. They're not super long. Uh, it breaks down a bit of like lineage, genealogy, and character bits in these different paragraphs. 
Uh, but it depends if you're a geek like me. It depends depends how dry you like your knowledge. I like my lo I like my knowledge the way I don't like my women. Dry as fuck. Oh, that's fascinating. Look at that. Wait, can I bounce this anywhere? Unusual surface here. Mm. Elvish, I think. What a weird chamber. The gaming book is okay-ish. It's just kind of, this is the story of Blah. Uh, this is the thing. I, I don't really want, like, I want the dry facts. I want the source material. I don't really want an interpretation of an interpretation. This is already, like, secondary source, right? Wait, did I just come from here? Sorry. Hey, another labor complete. More sonic booms. Yo, let's go. <gasps> gourds! They've got gourds! Thank you. Uh, God, how did this work again? There. We keep cooperating. Maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. Oh. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. The pros Edda, thank you so much. Yo, go get involved. We can compare notes. Yours, So yours is going to be more like poetry, I think. Oh no, sorry, the pros Edda is the one I got. Uh, so there's two. There's the prose Edda and there's the poetic Edda. Ooh, Hacksilver. This is a very low tunnel. Good for lying down, but not for standing up. Unless, of course, you're me. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Mm. Good wisdom. Yo, let's GTFO. I kind of feel bad for Odin, etc. before Kratos got here. Wasn't Odin a bit of a dick wank? No, 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 no. Don't feel bad for Odin. Odin's been manipulating shit. Odin was really nasty to people in the last game. Is that a monkey or a cat man? I'll let her do the work. We've had a really long stream today. I'm kind of relaxing. I'll let I'll let Freya put some hours in. Go on, go. You got him. That might take a while. What's this? Oh, can I get a fun angle on the attack? Go on, fuck him up. Hey, there we go. See why it's an abandoned service tunnel. That's the first time I've ever managed to do that. Careful, I've kept forgetting. That looks flammable. Flammable, you say? Oh, the liquid. Hmm. <laughs> okay, fascinating. I'll remember that next time when there's some bad guys. Vine whips it. Oh, 
Slow and steady, nice and gentle. And there's the pros. Ah, da, da. All right, all right, all right. All right, they're adorable. Come on now, don't be like that. We're better than that here. No, we're not. Oh, I'm so tired. Oh, getting a bit sleepy now. Ah, a fortuitous oil spill. Indeed. Oh, these caverns go on for ages. I'm in the Dwarven Kingdom, right? I'm just far underground. Go in there somewhere. From behind, More flammables. Kratos. Oh, Jesus. Kratos. I'm over here. Where are you going? You need a snack and a nice drink. I think I do. I could do a little bit Sendrick, of foodsies. Is that you? Yes. Foodsies or snapsies? To talk to Kratos. Hey. Please listen. You have to let me take Brock's place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. Oh, does she know no. he's dead? Do not ask again. But. Oh dear. <sighs> this has got to be something to do with Brock's death, right? I can hear some sound effects over here. Or is it up there on the other side? I'm not quite triggering it, but I should be. Ooh. Never mind, let's go around. It's not his fault Atreus ran off. Poor dwarves, or are I know. You just being Brock's Wonderful champion. poor eggs. There it is again. You're insinuating it. You know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who <laughs> changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. We're each entitled to our opinion. Oh, I could have done it from this side after all. Lovely jubbly, yes, please. This episode's going great, but I am, I've just hit a wall. I'm suddenly shutting down. A massive ice wave that inflicts frost damage. Eee, like a big ice wave. Oh, I can upgrade these. Oh, holy shit. Let's just upgrade damage on everything. Ooh, element or momentum? Uh, momentum actually sounds really cool. 
I want more swing. I can unequip these as well by the looks of it, so it's no worry. More damage. Uh, hmm. Protection. Greatly increases resistance to damage during this skill. Now, I actually want protection on this because doing this move takes ages. He really gets into it, uh, which makes me very vulnerable. So let's have that. Very good. Vrepens. Heavy runic attack. Uh, Ivaldi's Andal is good. Fog of Thimble Winter. Hmm. A coruscating wave that pushes them back and does a lot of frost. We might as well play with it for a little while. We don't have to keep it, but we can have fun with it. Uh, yo, an ashy goat. Hey, goat's in the house. How you doing, man? Welcome on in. Hey, Shadow. The God of Wolves. We are here to live my dream. These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. just seen it sorry i just saw it via the mirror what's good mikey yeah not much man we're just chilling out today actually i've actually been a bit ill so my sleeping pattern's ruined so i've been waking up in the middle of the night so we've been streaming for quite a long time today since the early hours of blackest night in an attempt to reset my sleep pattern so we're going a bit loopy and i've got a cough so i'm on the cough syrup how's life at your end I want to paint Kratos, but my brain don't want to. Um, turn Kratos into a hot waifu. And then, come on, we'll all paint her. Oh, Green Lantern's light in darkest night. Hey, uh. hey now, hey now. I'm so good at gaming. Oh, this is the other way. How to catch a deluge in a paper cup. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> A sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. Mm. Easy enough for me, though. We'll Even gates. though I take an awful lot of damage. Easy enough for me. I'm pretty good at this game. Despite the fact I barely make it every fight. Pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. I can make a burger. Uh, uh, oh, it's, ah, oh, it's more stuff. We've seen before, haven't we, brother? Ugh, yeah. Yes, Mimi. Seen the troughs before, Mimi. <gasps> oh, hey, Freya. Freya, you're looking a little bit dirty, babe. <gasps> Want a shower? Nice and clean. <laughs> nice and clean, Freya. There you go. Yeah. 
That worked. Shall we? Mm-hmm. This opinion of yours. Dude, Was that's that like saying anything to Nikki. Wait, what? You How did you end up with your name, your Mikey? Armies at Ragnarok. Was the singular mega that taken? Yeah, job, basically. <laughs> not mine. It's plain to see tears no war god anymore. No, uh, it's because Nor am um, I. I have left that life behind. It's also not really, really common. Or else, what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? It's your really choice. common for people you to take uh, YouTube be. names. I am only protecting I know. My... Oh, let me. I'll tell you a minute. I know. And we both know the places protecting your child can take you. It's really common to take YouTube names, which are two things together, like... I don't know. Pew D Pie and Ice Poseidon and shit like that. So, uh, I wanted, I wanted a hard free with, like, a hard rhythm. Mikey Mega Mega. Now, I wasn't really thinking hard about branding back then, but it was in the back of my head. It was mostly picking an email address. And because that was my email address, it then, it then became my YouTube account. Which then became my career. So I'm pretty glad it wasn't sexgod69 or something like that. At gmail.com. Shadow, how did you end up with your name? He's losing it. No, no, I'm fine, Idol. I'm fine. I've never been more fine in my life. Ah, never more fine in my life. The finest thing is you I sing. The finest friend of all. The finest love from all above. We're going to kill Heimdall. Oh, can I get closer? How about this? On set, it should be interacting. Oh, I don't know why that's not triggering it. Uh, I'm kind of not too bothered. I'm getting so sick and tired of these puzzles, I almost don't care. Yo, Mega Vega, have a bloody good sleep, I don't blame you. Hello, my pretty lady, Mikey. Ah, uh -huh. hi, Emma. How's your day gaming session going? It's going very well, thank you for asking, although I'm I'm ready for bed. How's your day been? Did you uh, cook with any of your shopping? Teenage me had to make a new name from a browser game called Fallen Sword. Just threw it together. You went for the double S, but that was it. Ten years. Now it's a bit, it's a little bit. Edgy. He walks for shadows. <laughs> that really should be doing the trick. But it's not, and that's okay. That is okay. Let's kill some people. Yeah. They get possessed by nightmares and become poisonous and more dangerous? Good god. Oh, where does this go? Watch your right! Oh, Jesus, sorry. Okay. 
Where are we at? I can hear one. Up there! Rip poison coming this way! Nice. I like to blow him up. <laughs> you can't. It's been many hours since I did the shopping. Trace I'm indulging myself in writing and right? art. She was one of the Yotnar. A little yes. indulgence. Good on you, dude. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with the disparity in size. Or number of limbs, see? Nothing in the world. Mm-hmm. That's monster fucker talk, that is. I'm here for it. I love the emo. It captures all the emotions I feel. <laughs> <laughs> Spider Man. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. It's good. He was for pro he was for progenitor of good Marvel villains. He really was the first one. We don't judge indeed. We do not judge. Oh, let's go. We're getting so close to I have no idea what. But we're achieving it. More dead dwarves. Oh, good, more of this. There. Now we can open the other gate. Why is it you ask? I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations, nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Mm. Now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? I feel like presume to know what she wanted. I feel like they've I'm been having the same conversation for the last six the hours. Secrets haunt every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you it's the only thing they've been talking doubts, about. They wouldn't explode when you talk to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put you on. You don't think she knew exactly what it meant, sending you to Jotunheim? This is mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, Good after lad. all. Good lad. Oh, sorry, that's the dead You're guy. Right. It's not for me to say. Mm -hmm. I don't know about the man. I'm not old like you. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, do, do, do I need a wee? Maybe I've gone in the wrong direction. I'm not a fan of Star Trek Insurrection. All right, let's get that wheel turning. No need, you already turned me on. You're really good at <gasps> turning me on. Do you think Freya is a robot? Let me know if I can help with that. That's a start. Would you like some file not found? Delicious, delicious file not human food. Why don't we try a sigil arrow on the upper trough? Should help it stay frozen. <laughs> That was teamwork. Have you touched grass today, old pretty lady Mikey Mike man? In Patrick's, I did. I went outside to collect my bin. So I had a good breath of fresh air and I looked up and down my road. Uh, and that was very healthy of me. Thanks for asking. I walked all the way to the end of my drive. Oh, fucker. There's two of them. And they're rising. <laughs> Oh. 
No, don't lock on, don't lock on. You do the thing, do the thing. Did that help? Maybe not. Maybe a little. Watch out. Oh, only just only just made that. I will take all that help, thank you. Well, who's ready for some fresh air after that? Oh, we, we already had our fresh air. Hey, how you doing, man? I can feel it. It kind of reminds me of when you play Bioshock Infinite, and when you get into the fight, all the violins are like, da 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 ra ra ra. But when the fight's over, it all just goes. Yo, Hamongji, how are you, man? Oh, you're vivacious, Alice. Thank you so much again. All right, guys, I'm turning in early to catch up on sleep. Super fun hanging out. Yeah, it was actually, Alice. Thank you very much for vibing long. I do keep to yeah no i'm going to bed really really soon thank you guys for hanging out with me i'm forcing my sleeping pattern to be a little bit better and it is already looking like it's going to be much much better than it was as long as we get it right tentatively careful quietly hopeful look is my health increasing over time oh dust of realms thank you now, I don't know about you guys, but I have absolutely no fucking idea where we are. Oh, this is where I am. We are in a dwarven kingdom. We were in the mines where we took the train. God, doesn't it feel like a million years ago? We rode the train and uh, uh, Atreus did a swear word. And we got told off. Good night, you lovely people. I wasn't trying to provoke you or hey, cast Dodge. Hey, doubt doing? on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And I know something about that. Yeah, Todge. But dude, the, the game started getting really good. I couldn't stop. Like, it got really, really intriguing and really powerful again. So we kept playing. Uh, and also, the later I stay up, the more I reset my sleeping pattern better. Uh, however, I need to go for a wee, uh, but we are struggling now. I'm definitely hitting a wall. I will be right back. I'm just going to have a quick think about my life and my decisions that got me here. Right, thanks for holding on. Oh, God, that thing's kicked in again. Sorry. Uh, don't hit a wall. You can do this. Have you finished this now? No, Todd, the game's still going. I think we're only halfway through, but this game is really something. Uh, do you know what doesn't make sense about Captain America's Civil War? No way does a billionaire Tony Stark sign up to government oversight or i think he gets a lot of tax cuts by doing that and the reason why he signed up for uh the government oversight is because of the events of uh age of ultron the whole point was that he knew at the end of age of ultron he felt bad for going too far and not having that element of oversight so he's had a completely different set of experiences than captain america to reach that decision now he's wrong captain america is right in in civil war it's not even it's not like open to interpretation captain america's team is correct tony stark is in the wrong and if you think that everybody should have signed up for government oversight with tony stark in captain america civil war then it basically just means you love the police so if you want to suck for blue lives matter d you're more than welcome to i don't have a opinion on either side but it says a lot about who you are that you basically love a fascist dystopian police state. Whereas Captain America loved genuine freedom. Eh, it's up to you, it's up to you. Hey, kid Ludens, how you doing, man? Welcome on back in. Ah, you didn't answer my question, bruv. How do you feel about the bing between a Kratos and a Freya? The, the bing between Kratos and Freya? 
an uneasy alliance, but the more she gets to know Kratos, she starts to understand his past and why he's so wise. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. She's she's gotten over it ages ago now in this in our playthrough. Now she's just constantly nagging at him to join her in the war. But I thought all the like all the scenes where she had to come to a decision with all the mocap and stuff was really, really good. But now it's just endless dialogue whilst we're dungeon crawling. How are you doing? Come on. Are you playing this game yourself, by the way? My rec, more eight more hours. No, eight hours of sleep, thank you. Don't you fucking go team cap on me, Beardy. I'll bring Wait, no shit! Todge, are you on Tony Stark's side in Civil War? Todge! You snivelling little state monkey. Fucking hell, I had no idea. It makes sense, but it's funny if out of context. Oh no, I agree, I agree. Yeah, I think the secret when we truth get out of here, I'll give you some space. is that by signing Let up... Let think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make cuts. this weapon. And to use it. Mike is the kind of guy that didn't want a 9-to-5 job. Instead choosing to make his money independently, meaning he now works 24 hours a day, yay. No, I don't like that, Emma, that's too real. Don't say that, that's very close to the bone. Congratulations, you've now made your hobby your job. Forever. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'll see what yeah, else we're I out. can learn while we're here. Ooh, Jesus Maybe I'll right. send a few Ain hair yar back to Valhalla for good measure. Just clean them well, first. You have fun now. Hey, you made it. About time. I got everything all set here. Yo, I know now exactly we where we are. Push on up to the fort. Falky. Ah, how convenient, Freya. Now she can spread her wings. Unfortunately, I broke the train. So we can't take the train down oh, like last time. Oh, that's an ingredient. Wait a minute. Uh, that is a genuine bona fide uh, ingredient over there. Fine. Take your fancy dancy I will. I think I don't mind stretching my legs. Your little legs. Stretch your little peepers. Rock's nearly as short as I am. Oh, yeah, good point. Okay, where am I compared to what I saw? Uh, uh, it's somewhere down here. Oh, what's that over there? Guys, I think there's loads more enemies here compared to last time. And they're probably a bit tougher. We might have a little, <laughs> little bit of a tussle whilst we're here. But we just saw one of those markers with the heart, which means there's ingredients. Todgy, if I see a situation going Todd stroke Stark, I wish I could ignore it. No, you don't. I'm not on the state monkey. I'm just always on Stark's side because he's sexy. Oh, I see. Carlos is on Team Spider-Man. I'm not going to go through it right now. But that's one of the most important parts of Captain America's Civil War. Tony Stark's values in Spider-Man reflecting Captain America. Forcing him to realise he's in the wrong. This game would be better if it's free to play of a battle pass. Oh my god, Kid Ludens. Are you telling me it's time to start playing? Call of Duty, Michael Whitehead. They put my name on it. They put my name on it. Think about it this way, Mikey. You're sacrificing your mental health and well-being to warn others who wish to walk the same path as yourself. You're a martyr. All bowed to the Megaverse cult stuff. Absolutely. Martyrs get sucked off, right? That's how it works. How are we doing for time? Yeah, let's do a bit of fighting. Uh, around here, I do need to find that heart. Are you going to help, Brock? <laughs> Look at his run. How about now? There we go. 
Oh, that's done. That's stunned everyone. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh, I missed it. Nice. Oh, I quite like that. Oh, is this door open now? Hang on. Almost got it. Yo, we couldn't go here before. Well, come on in, stranger. I never do get used to that trick. Oh, wait a minute. I don't want to go there yet. It's like a giant loading screen. Very cool, though. Very cool. Now, where do I need to go? Either that will get burned at the stake. You got caught. Yeah, I like the single campaign. I still haven't downloaded the single campaign. There's nothing on that CD. That CD's got like a, apparently like a seven megabyte permission file to download the actual game. I was not impressed by that at all. Not find that funny. I want to get down here and get in those fights. Let's go up along and around. Where am I even going on the map? Oh, my objective's all the way up here. Oh, yeah, okay. So that was the right door a minute ago. Yeah, it's just the key on the disc. Oh, See, so you can't, they don't let you own games anymore. They won't let you own a game. Another game would be the game. But they won't let you own it. You can only ever temporarily be permitted to have it for as long as they let you. And this is the dystopian future. You'll never be able to buy anything. You can only rent stuff, so you're constantly suckling at the teat of big industry. I fucking hate it. You can't own Photoshop. You can only rent it monthly. You can't own Clip Studio Paint. You can only rent it monthly. This is literally the future. Oh my god, don't start! You'll start ranting about angry stuff. Don't do it. Don't do it. Yeah. Okay, Emma, good shout. Good shout. I was about to repeat myself going down a dark alley of the same old bullshit I say every day. You are correct, Emma. Now, it's not always that you're correct. Sometimes you're a little bit moody. But I'm going to be honest, Emma. You've been correct a lot recently. I'll, I'll let that one go. Try sticking your hand in that thing. <laughs> That's code for his asshole. Oh, more of these girls. Oh, are they, are they in place of Valkyries? I do apologize. How are we doing for time? Okay, we'll have one more go on these and then we'll save. <laughs> hey, try sticking your hand in that thing. Red, come on. Oh. I was kidding, you Right side, brother. They're behind. <laughs> just came out of nowhere. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh, she is a, she is a lot more difficult than others. High stagger. <sighs> Ooh. Ooh, can I fit in one more go? One last go. Hashtag one last go. You're buying everything physical, yeah, if possible. A PS5 must be on fire right now. Yeah, it's probably probably pumping out a good bit of warmth. I don't have my heating on. My house is really hot and it's really cold outside. I think that's all because all my monitors are my PS5. 
What are you playing in a moment, Emma? I'm going to go back to calling you Empatics for a bit. What are you playing in a moment, Empatics? Any gaming? Hey, You're gay. Try sticking your hand in that thing. No coming <laughs> I still, do you know what? I should probably have my shield up. Oh, Jesus. There we go. I'm going to go for the stagger this time. Oh. Ah, still didn't dodge in time. Oh, Jesus. That's the menu again. Ah. Sorry, I was going barehanded trying to get a stagger bar up. Very last go, very last go. I'm playing New Vegas again. And doing a bit of role playing. Careful. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's exactly where I was going. Uh, very fun. Doing some Diablo 2 with my boyfriend and his buddies. Much fun. Oh, Diablo 2. Nice one. <laughs> nice one. Uh, okay, this is it. One more before bed. This time I'm going to actually use my shield before she comes out and spices me. Oh, I missed it. Okay, his big boomer is ultimate stun. It's so fucking good. I'm trying to get rid of the annoying side cat. But the moment you deal with one, you get fucked by the other. Ah. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. I don't think I'm getting up from that. I think I just had my face chewed off. Guys, okay, we've got ourselves a lovely fight to sink our teeth into. I'm very excited about it. And we'll be doing it in the next episode. Click like, click subscribe, you wonderful people on YouTube. Follow that playlist to join us live on Twitch for another episode of Let's Play God of War Ragnarok. Peace.